This is Twit. There aren't any, huh? It's true. There aren't any AI words in this No, that's another article. That's a separate article. Oh, I see. Okay. Yeah, that's a Fast Company uh, article, Um, which we can skip. I mean, it's silly. (laughs) It's, uh, but I, well, we'll get to the good stuff, but first we'll do the boring stuff. How about that? Okay. We'll, we'll take some medicine yeah. first. A little, the spoonful of medicine. Sugar. Mix the, the sugar, sugar go the down. Sugar. From okay, AI. Wait. I'll give you one. I don't know if it's on here. Do you guys know what clankers? No. Have you heard of clankers? Shh. Don't tell us. Okay. We could have a little contest. From AI washing oh, to I sloppers. I heard it too. Shoot. Five AI slang terms you need to know. Michael Grothaus writing at uh, Fast Company. Oh, AI Clanker washing. is on it. Don't scroll down and uh, do Clankers it. Clankers is on it? Yes, the one after AI washing. Don't, don't, don't scroll. Don't ruin it for yourself. All right, AI washing. What do you guys think? Uh, so it's not doing your laundry it's referring to the deceptive marketing practice where companies exaggerate the role ai plays in their product or service which is pretty much everybody right it's it's my my joke that all beatloaf now has to have ai gravy (laughs) everything was made with ai right that's good of course you can't you go to nowadays you go to a fast food drive-through and the, the it's ai taking your order there's some funny TikTok. Well, no, no, no. That's not technically AI washing. AI washing is when you're kind of falsely doing it. When you oh, this say is, like, really doing when it. you're like this, uh, this website this where you order your with... Indian food is AI powered. And I'm like, no, it's not. I'm just placing an order to my local Indian restaurant. <laughs> right. Right. Uh, all right. Clankers. I don't, I'm not going to scroll down. What, what, clanker. what do you think clanker refers to? Shoot. I heard in, it, uh, I heard in, it in uh, context. In steel Perhaps production, using the there's sentence. clinkers. <laughs> clankers. I don't know. Clinkers are like, uh, no, what is a clanker? I don't know. I do you want it in a sentence? Sure. You gosh darn clanker, get out of here. <laughs> <laughs> that didn't help. No. Okay, we know it's an epithet. Uh, it's uh, it means Is that it you PM? are a robot, not a human. It's a way to speak derogatory. It's like a derogative, uh, d- dismissive way to speak about AI. Yeah, uh, metal. Or yeah. like, yeah, you're. It's uh, instead of being like AI slop, you'd be like, it's a clanker. Get out of here. Like, well, he get doesn't want to do here. that because he's afraid they're going to come back and hear this and they're going to get him. So yeah, it's it, a derogatory. It's surprised term that you know this because it comes from Star Wars. Oh, is it? I feel like I've seen this on Instagram posts a lot. Well, a lot of other people have seen Star Wars, even if you haven't. Uh, Here's the sentence you should have given us from Fast Company. I called my bank to ask about my balance, but I had to talk to a clanker instead of a human. Oh, that's good. That's good. That is good. That is good. How about a grok sucker? (laughs) (laughs) I can guess. I I can guess. (laughs) (laughs) It comes from grok, of course. Uh, if you ask Grok, it says the term describes, quote, people who frequently interact with me, Grok, in a way to find, in a way some find repetitive or annoying. It's tied to concerns about AI overuse or privacy on X. You Grok sucker. I'm going to use that. I don't know where I'll use it, but I'm going to use that. That's a good one. Slop, we've heard before. Of oh, course, yeah. that's the AI generated that's, that's content. You Grok sucking yeah. clanker head. <laughs> Slop. Maker, it you says here. Sucking, <laughs> you clanking, sucking, slop maker, slop lover, clanker head. It gives as an example, and it's kind of timely of uh, <laughs> slop AI shrimp Jesus. <laughs> but where is radioactive AI shrimp Jesus? Yeah, yeah. This is Jesus in the clouds on a fork, but it's a shrimp. Hey, I hope you enjoyed this highlight from intelligent machines you know we do the show every wednesday you can watch us do it live or as they say like and subscribe there's a link down below thanks